Hi everyone, I'm Bruce Schwartz. Thanks so much for the interest that you all have in my channel. Thanks for stopping by guys, the comments, subscribing, the contributions, the sharing, and the interest, the curiosity, right? I'm just as curious as you all for what is up there on the surface of the moon. So every time I get a chance, I go out with my telescope to try to get some lunar surface. And then I bring it into my programs and I try to get as clear, as close as I can in a presentable way without shaking too much so that you all can see the beauty of the surface. Because this all goes by in a flash of an eye. And of course, uh, what many don't know, people just say, why don't you just stop and film a crater? Well, you can't actually stop and film a crater. Hard to understand. The moon is locked in place. Well, or is it?
guys it is hot here and well listen we complain when it's cold here in Canada and then when it gets hot we complain it's hot because there's no comfortable temperatures here it's we're popsicles or we're hot dogs that's what Canada is and the weather is changing for us here in Canada as much as everywhere else in the world but the thing is I consider ourselves extremely lucky here I mean volcanoes earthquakes landslides fissures I mean farmers are watching fissures in their on their land it's not something that's happened very often did it I never remember any volcano there's Mount St. Helen of course I I may be mistaken by a year is it 1981 or 1980 uh, yeah Mount St. Helen you know not so far from here even and the thing is, what's going on now in the, uh, in the world, everywhere in the world, it's going to affect us all entirely bit by bit. So more earthquakes, um, where there's supposed to be earthquakes, more landslides, um, drought where people and towns usually flood and where towns usually flood, well, drought, it's the opposite's gonna occur in many areas. Recently, neutron stars, two of them, collided together, causing a possible unbalancement of the entire universe. There are so many theories out there, great theories on what exactly could be happening. Some are also saying, and it's true, that the sun is going, you know, to calm down. It's going to totally, totally be dead for the longest time. Are we looking at another ice age? Is that what's uh, changing or and or causing the volcanoes? here I mean we just never know and I find we're getting carried away in all of this and we don't take enough time to examine what's going on